Tom, how truly outstanding day for Middlesex? Yeah, brilliant day. Um, couldn't have asked for more at the start of the day. Um, winning the toss always helps. We bowled brilliantly as a group, I think. Um, and then Rocky and Robbie there played brilliantly towards the end and you know put a real stamp on the day for us. You look at that pace bowling attack that you're now a, a major part of. Yourself, Rojo, Shaheen, Ethan coming in for this one. That's four incredibly strong seamers there that are literally putting it in all the right areas every ball. Yeah, no, it's been it's been really really nice to be a part of the last sort of few weeks. Um, you know, Ethan be bowled I think three four overs before lunch today, so it's something he's probably not done for a while. But if you've got a guy like that who wasn't necessarily needed much before lunch, then something's going right. How much of a lift is it given to the pace bowling unit to have someone like Shaheen come in? Two, three years ago, Mertz was injured. We'd have probably looked at that as a major negative. But someone like Shane coming in, it's not a bad swap. Yeah, no, he's gone all right so far. He, um, I was saying earlier, he just loves he loves bowling. He wants to take wickets every time he bowls. He wants to take 10 wickets every match. Um, and you can see that. And like I said, he, he knocked over one, two, and three in the last couple of weeks. And that makes everyone else's life so much easier. Um, yeah, it's not going to happen every week, but we hope it does. So, <laughs> Absolutely. Tell me your own form. I think that's 14 wickets now for you this season you're bowling unbelievably economically as well your average is insane you must be delighted with after a, a troublesome few years really with injury to really come back fighting the strong this year yeah um i've had a really nice winter i said really nice winter it's been it's been really good we've put in some really hard work um john over being back is really really helpful from my point of view um and it's been something i've been wanting to do for a while you know i didn't know how much i was going to play at the start of the year and, and how it was going to pan out um but i'm very pleased with how it's going so far and still a lot of work to do Absolutely. And how is the body? I mean, obviously you, you've got a very strong kind of squad around you. you. You've got plenty of support. Obviously, there are people missing out. We've got Blake Cullen who's yet to feature. Um, your intention is presumably to just play as much as you can. Yeah, absolutely. I, I'm desperate to play as much cricket as I can. Um, but, you know, I'm also, I'm, I'm no fool. I know that it takes a lot of stress and I've not played heaps of cricket in the past. So, and I think the word rotation gets thrown around a lot, but I think in the right circumstances, everyone's fine with it. You know, it, it comes to a place where you play three games in a row and you do need a rest and no one has an issue with that. It's when you play one game, you bowl 15 overs and then you're being rested the next week. That, that's where that kind of thing gets annoying. Um, but yeah, everyone's in a really good place um, and long may it continue. Absolutely. A dream day for Middlesex today, as I said earlier. Uh, near parity at the end of the day, eight wickets in hand. Too early to talk about a game plan? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Um, we'll turn up tomorrow. You know, we'll pat ourselves on the back for yesterday, but that's gone. That's gone now. Um, turn up, start again tomorrow, and try and drive this game forward in our positions. And we well done. Brilliant day. Thanks, Tesh.